this guy. Because why not? Hmm. Yeah, I know. Lots of episodes. It's just the way that it is. Demon techniques. Your former fellow apprentice has joined the enemy. I'm sure you must be feeling a lot of complex emotions right now, but you must stay focused. Don't worry about it, Flan. I'll show that kid a thing or two. But you're telling me you don't feel bad about what Zero Can has done? No anger? No sense of betrayal? Not really. The guy you're fighting against is trying to bring about an ultimate demon revival, after all. If you allow yourself even a moment's hesitation, he will defeat you. Ah, uh, there is no room for mistakes when it comes to the ultimate demon. Forget it. We should just get started. Dry, let's get going. Okay. Jeez, what am I, the new fucking Laharl? Man, these girls are treating me like Laharl. I don't like this. Oh yeah, my brother bought a Niz America game lately. Uh, called The Swamp Witch in the 100 Night. It's a PS2 game, but it's like ported from the PS4. Uh, it's a PS2 ported game from the, on the PS4. My brother bought it because it was a sale. And we were able to find a lot of other good games that I might want to save my money for. Oh, that's right. I gave my money to my brother. He's actually, uh... That's right. He's gonna go get his fucking Nintendo cards. I don't know when the fuck he's coming back. Um... He must have either called me or something. I know my brother will be back, so... Here's hoping nothing bad happens. Alright, turn 21, not bad. In Mario Party, sorry, sorry, I'm talking about Mario Party. Yeah, well, I logged on into the game, I helped out my brother a little bit, and I traded the guys by uh, multi skipping, uh, which is great, which I skipped so much dungeons, and I got a lot of experience. So that's why the guys are a bit more powerful, because my brother, I guess he did some awakening off screen, which I thank him for. So I can get more of this game done. But I am getting Fire Emblem Heroes done, surprisingly. The paralogs are actually really quick, so I might just breeze through them. The game might be done a lot sooner than you guys actually expected. Because I have multiple ways to, like, use videos for recording, for, like, work, so. Even the new one, like Mega Man The Wily Wars, very quick.
dope. The search is going well. Oof. Ouch, my ribs! They're broken! I don't want my mommy! <laughs> okay, you went on about this guy like he was someone special. He's nothing but a scaredy cat. I guess even overlords cry for their mommy sometimes. Hey, Zero Ken. Huh. Oh, hey, bro, it's you! Zero Ken is known as the man who revived the ultimate demon techniques. In the past, he was a timid teenager who worshipped Goldion. But eventually, he became an overlord who fights for those he cherishes. All modern martial art techniques in the netherworld are branches of the ultimate demon techniques, bearing witness to his extraordinary achievements. Amazing, Dry. We already resurrected three of the five overlords. Maybe now he can teach us the ultimate demon techniques. What do you think, Dry? You're not gonna sit down for teaching fucking Edna, are you kidding me? I'm sorry for my swearing and high level of language, but are you kidding me? You're lazy as fuck. All you wanna do is sit around and eat desserts. I know how you work, Etna. You're not gonna fucking listen. You're just gonna make me do it. <laughs> what am I, a pretty? Honestly, I have poor sympathy for those fucks, but again... They have sinned. Whether it was an innocent full sin or very bad sin, they have sinned nonetheless. <laughs> so, can I really feel sympathy for a person who has sinned? Just saying, man. Depends upon the sin, but again. You don't want to pamper them, because then... You need some toughness. Builds character. Brings them back to humanity that not everything is fucking rainbows, and you can't get everything you want. That's what I understand, for mostly. I get off my ass. If I want food, I cook it. If I want to do an LP, I sit down and work my body through to be able to make sure I make the best stuff ever. But, uh, I was going through a bunch of old LP, uh, Let's Players I used to watch back when I was younger. Um, game- guys like, uh, Nufi Bonga, uh, Kenshin, one- 1913, H.C. Bailey, Slim Kirby, and Chugga Conroy, just to name a few. I loved watching those dudes. Those dudes are the reason why they got into, like, got me into half of the fucking games that I play- that I actually play, actually. Uh, Nubanga actually got me into Street Fighter. I know, shocker. I I do a lot of research. I go into a lot of genres, so... That's why I have a lot of genres on my fucking channel in the first place. I, whether it be action-adventure, puzzle, dating... Novel-like games... Mobile games, racing, fighting game, puzzle... Okay, good. Game, you're working. Great. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm looking at the fucking AI stabbing its bum. I'll try to ground pound on the fucking wooden planks. It's absolutely funny, but stupid at the same time. So tell us how the AI works. It's stupid. Dummy stupid, but that's how it works. Sit up, BAKANA! <laughs> How dare you make her forget your technique! Infernal FINGER! <laughs> You're dead. Alright, good job, guys. We beat the chapter. Or stage. My brain works sometimes, it just doesn't. Whatever it wants to work, I guess. 
Alright, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Let's play Disgaea RPG. Alright, bye guys, stay crispy.